Assalamu alaikum dear friends today in 2020 i am here to explain and telling that how to solve that size of practical of regression in which we will find regression line by on x and show that mission y minus y cap is equal to 0 i will also compute that standard error estimate as y dot x so lecture is very very interesting so don't skip any step because each step of that lecture is very very important so let's start the lecture so here that is given here x and y values are already given you have to first calculate here regression line regression line i have already discussed in my last lecture now moving the next point here y hat is equal to a plus b x that is our regression line and that's a and b very simple a is y x and b is y x so very simple the formulas i already discussed here a y x is equal to y bar minus b y x x bar so that's formula we use for a very simple and last formula b y x is equal to n smission x y minus smission x Mission y divided by here x shows that the formula will be here n mission x square minus mission capital X operating so scale. So that formula we use for b x and that's y bar x bar you can easily calculate because y bar is equal to mission y over small n and x bar is equal to mission x over small n. So first of all move n and now the number of values count that 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So we have the number of values here. N is 9. Now, submission X, submission Y, adding that values, you will get here submission X. And adding that values, you will get here submission Y. Put all values in that. You can easily calculate Y bar and X bar. And now, easily calculate, you have to calculate that. So you uh, x y you have to calculate x y very simple we just multiply together x and y easily we find multiply by you can easily solve that uh, 5 multiplied by 16 you get the value here 80 and up to so 6 multiplied by 18 you can easily get you i will just give you hint about that you can do it himself uh, right here uh, submission x y but in adding that value, you can get submission x square. And last step is here x square. You can easily calculate right here x square. Very easy. Just yes, you can see that x square. You get 5 square, 25, 6 square, 33, and up to so on. You can do it in sum. Why right here submission x square? Put all sums in that section. Now you easily calculate A, B, easily you can easily calculate. And last step will be here, we will write here y hat is equal to a plus b x. After that, we will write here that's now you can easily calculate because x values are given 5, 6, 8. So each value will be different regression. Must remember, we put a and b capital value will be here. Now x value will be here 5. So you can say that a plus b x 5 capital value and similarly 6 up to so you can easily get all values of regression i hope that you have cleared the point and concept you can easily calculate now moving my next point next point is here submission y minus y hat completely scale you can easily calculate we will just put here y minus y cap just first of all right here that's y value y minus y hat 16 minus of 10 value 19 minus this value you can easily calculate y minus y hat and must remember that submission y minus y hat must be zero because that is the main point of that video must remember that submission will be zero must calculate that value that and you can uh, do you can uh, tell me about in comment section next next section here last step is here standard error of estimate you have to calculate S Y to S. So last step is very very important. Now going by next point. Next point is here. You have to calculate uh, S Y to S. 
So must remember that the formula of standard of estimate, I am writing the formula which is very very important, is equal to summation y minus y cap completing square divided by n minus 2. So that is the standard of estimate, you can say that standard deviation of regression. You can easily do that, we will put here that value. Now you can easily calculate that value, we will put here y minus y hat completing square I put all so all values here will write here completing square. You can do it in cell. Adding that value, you can get here summation y minus y cap i. That value you put here, that section, and then taking square root, you can easily calculate uh, s by root x. So I hope that you have clear concepts in that. Thanks for watching the video. If you like this video, then can you must subscribe to my YouTube channel and must press bell icon button for getting notification of my new lecture and new practical and must remember uh, all practical uh, remaining part practical links are available in description you can also watch other lectures goodbye